Hello. Hello. How, How are you? Are you? I'm doing good. How are you? I'm, I'm good. Sorry. I'm good. Hold on one second. Sure, sure, sure. Hi, I'm holding my baby. I'm sorry. Oh, no, you're fine. You're fine. <laughs> um, I never expect you to um, <laughs> answer me, so I'm never prepared. Do, do you oh. have anything for me as far as um, my dad recently lost? He's been here for 45 years. He's from Kenya. Um, and he lost all of his siblings, and I mean all of them, um, while he was here. And he just recently lost his sister. And I've never met any of my aunts and uncles over there, so he's having a really hard time right now. And he's really ill, and he's really stressed about it. But is there anything that you could tell me about any of my family members that are that have passed for him? Mm -hmm. Yeah, let's go with the sister because she's the one that recent, most recently passed. Um, she's acknowledging, thank you. She's showing me the month of February. Do you know if February is connected? Yeah, that's his birthday. His February okay, so she's probably acknowledging his birthday or his, his date. She's also acknowledging mm -hmm. the 12th as well. Do you know if the 12th or December is also connected? Um, my son, December. My, my son was just born in December. Oh, okay, got it, got it. So she's probably yeah. just acknowledging like what's been going on lately. What's up with that? She says mm -hmm. to tell your father that he has grandchildren to be there for, and that he is not allowed to let go or to go anywhere because he must honor the family, and that they have all agreed that he must remain to honor the family and to be the example, to carry the traditions, to carry the family stories. He is the yeah. keeper now, and he needs to carry the family stories. She says, if he shows up early, he's going to have to wait. So oh. she's letting him know he needs mm -hmm. to try everything to stay around because it is not his time and he has family that he must live for. Um, and he must yeah. honor them. If he goes, all that they have, all that they possess will be lost with him. Mm -hmm. So he needs to, she says, give him the task of writing it down and writing about us and creating a story about us. So she wants him okay. to work on that and to focus on that. She tried to tell him this in a dream because he may have had a dream of her. And she says she was okay. trying to communicate with him to let him know that it's okay and that he still needs to be here because there are things he's still meant to do. So yeah. she's acknowledging this for him. Um, kaki. Um, kiki or Kaki? Do you know there's a Kiki or Kaki name or nickname? Um, kaki... No, um, uh, Kiki, my brother's Kiki, middle Kika or Kaki sounding. Uh, my brother's middle name is Kyoko. Okay. Um, I don't know. Is that I don't, from another loved one or is that someone else's name? Kaki? No, that's just my, my brother's middle name. So I, okay. there's probably a name that I just don't, I, I don't really yeah. know. She's acknowledging the name connection and she's acknowledging the similarity or that there's, it's been passed down or it was like, like a holy name, a holy name, a holy name. I'm not sure where she's going with this, but she's talking about like a holy name and she's bringing this up for some reason. So I'm not sure okay. what that means. Um, mm -hmm. She also keeps, thank you. She also keeps acknowledging she showed me January as well. So she's making reference to January, but she's also making the symbol for a baby as well. Do you know of another baby that's coming into the family or if there's been an announcement of another child coming in? Um, my cousin is pregnant, um, okay. a little girl. Got yeah. So she's acknowledging about the, there's another baby. Again, there's another baby coming in. So she's acknowledging the baby coming in. She did show me January. So either the first of the month is connected or January may be significant with that because she brought mm -hmm. it up right after that mention as well. Um, mm -hmm. There's another name she's trying to give me. This is going to sound weird. It's either the English version of it that I would say associate with would be like Samantha or Sammy or, 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 or uh, I'm hearing the version of that like Samantha, but I want to change it. And I want to say, and I want to say Samosa. I don't know how to pronounce that. Do you know there's also another name that sounds like Samantha or Samosa mixed? Mm -hmm. Like I know a Sundi like or Simeo, Simeo, Simeon. There's like a name I know there. a Sundi. That's her son. Oh, that's her son. Yeah, Sundi. One of her sons. 
See, again, I don't know. So I, I wish I knew more about okay. that. No, you're, fine. you're fine. You're fine. She, I'm asking her if she can validate that. Did he try marrying twice or was there two attempts for him to try to get into a relationship? Um, maybe. Okay. Because <laughs> she's acknowledging marriage twice or two attempts. So there's something yeah. there that I think she wants to pass on or pass over to him. So you might need yeah. to confirm that or validate that for him as well. Um, there's another female I want to acknowledge. This is not a family member, though. There's another female in spirit. I want to say her name is like Janine, Jennifer, Genevieve. There's like another female that's acknowledging the name connection to that. She also makes me feel like she passed from a health condition or a health um, issue that was affecting her for a while. Something like when someone has like um, diabetes or when they have um, like, a, like a defective something. There's something about like something's eating away at me, eating away at me. She's connecting herself to school. Do you know anyone connected to a female or a female connection through school that's got those elements to it? Um, not that I can think of. Genevieve, uh, Janine, Jen, it's got a name like that that's connected to My her. My stepmom has an Aunt Genevieve um, that passed away, but she's older. Is it an older woman? She, well, it, the woman in my head does look older, so she is older. I just don't know oh, if that's good. the same. Hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Did she pass from like um, a condition like diabetes or there was like a, um, there was like an accumulation in her liver? I don't know. Genevieve, I'm trying to think. You said it wasn't family related? I didn't think to me? it was. I didn't think um, it was. I was thinking this was like a female you knew in school or someone that may have been connected through like, you know, college or school or something like that. Because I almost felt, but it felt know. like I young, think about that. It, but it felt like an older person. That's the thing. It didn't feel like a friend. It felt like a teacher or like a mentor or like it had a feeling like that. But it um, felt like it was an older female. And I want to tie either that or the female that you mentioned worked at a school. But there's a reference to something. That um, makes Mrs. Um... Was she a Spanish teacher? I'm trying to think. But the name would be like a similar name to what I mentioned. Oh, I can't even think of her name right now. It's right on the tip of my tongue. That's okay. Um, I'll leave that with you. But if you look, okay. if you look, you have to look some things up. But there's like, like almost as if like someone's liver failed or someone's kidneys failed or there was, like, mm -hmm. and there was also like a diabetic or a blood sugar issue that might have been tied to it. But okay. this female is just like wanting to pop in and say hello to you. Um, did you okay. used to do a lot of creative writing or was there like a lot of writing that you used to do before? Um, I used to draw. Okay. Oh, She's doing this as if whatever you were doing that was creative uh -huh. was connected to her. Um, you're going to have to do that. Okay. Yeah, okay. Um, she, she, she is... I wouldn't say she's a heavy set woman, but she's a curvier woman um, because she comes across in that way. It also feels like um, she's funny because she's wearing those special shoes that like some of these older ladies wear. It's like those old nursing shoes that old nurses yeah. wear. Like those yeah. thick shoes. She's showing mm -hmm. that to me as well. Um, she may have also had, during the time you knew her, she might have had a procedure with a leg or something had happened with her leg at one point and she had okay. to have like a little time away from work. But this is a connection to a school. So there's some school tied to this female. Mm, think I about think it. About yeah, think about it. Go back and look at your books and see if you can, but she's just popping in and saying hi. I don't know why. She's, well, okay. Okay. she's also pretty <laughs> to be creative again. So she might be trying okay. to bring up or to reignite this thing that you've kind of neglected. Okay, I will do that. I have one more thing. Okay, I, you've told me before that my fiance with his business, we just purchased another truck. Um, I just wanted to know if you could tell me anything about the business. Mm -hmm. I know, or any baby energy that's around me still. Is that baby yeah, energy? Oh, gosh. Uh, um, uh, the business feels good. I think this is going to continue to grow. Um, he's going to need mm -hmm. some, some more help, though. Did I tell you that he would bring on another person or someone else would come in and work as well? With yeah. The, yep. okay. mm -hmm. um, the truck that y'all just bought, was this a previously owned vehicle? Yeah, it was. Okay. Mm -hmm. The one of the, the is this like a like eighteen wheeler truck? Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. I don't know enough about the vehicle mechanics because I don't I never worked on them. But okay. the sensor or the readout or the reading for the light switches is a little weaker or needs to be completely replaced because something feels a little off there. So if y'all test it, it may y'all know about it? Yeah, I do. Yeah, he's trying to figure that one out right now. Yeah, I feel like it's like, I feel like the wiring has either been just like, it's either been degraded over time or just needs to be replaced. Yeah. And then that's okay. pretty much take care of it. 
Okay. okay. All right. All right, All right. Well, you All right. Thank you so much. You're welcome. You too. Thank you. Have a good one. Bye-bye.